Get in your positions. Oh my goodness. Yes, just like that, Gina. Just like that. You are too fab. Now I want to see Angelo. Angelo, give me that gorge model stare right into the camera. Magnificent Annabella. Show me that catwalk, girl. She's a natural. Absolute natural. I'm the best model in all of Brookhaven. Yes, girl. You most definitely are. Well, I mean, we are the most gorgeous people in Brookhaven. They did rate us the most famous model family in Brookhaven. Yeah, all of that doesn't matter because we are the ones here modeling for Vogue. You got that right, honey. Meanwhile. Ugh, I wish I was part of the Brookhaven model family. Her daughter is so lucky. Why can't I be a model? You could always be an IG model, Kenzie. Everyone can do that, though. I want to be a model just like them. Honestly, it would probably suck. Are you crazy, girly? How? Well, you definitely wouldn't be able to eat whatever you want. And, like, you'd always be eating boring, healthy food. I doubt that. They're probably just born that way. Ugh. A few moments later. What's the point of having personal drivers if we've got to walk all the time? Or exercise. Stop complaining. You're a model. Ugh. We are going to leave without you if you don't hurry up. Yeah. My sweet, sweet angel! What's going on? Ow! I can't feel anything! Oh, my beautiful daughter's face is ruined! No! Being struck by lightning will definitely do that. A few moments later. She doesn't have much longer. Hey, Dad! Pull my finger! Okay! Oh, that's disgusting! I think I'm gonna barf! <gasps> She's definitely super dead now and never coming back to life. We need to make Fistus moves ASAP then, or else the other model family that totally sucks will replace us because they have a kid and we don't. Right, but how? Well, we need to inform everyone that we're having a competition to adopt a new model daughter. <gasps> I'm alive! Ah! Well, it looks like you still have a daughter and don't have to do that competition. Goodness, with a face like that, there is no way on earth. The next day... weird these days. Oh, you're preaching, girly. Let us in right now. This is super urgent. The store is closed. I'm not telling you again. Stop getting in our way. We will force our way in if we have to. Weird. You're telling me. Breaking news here in Brookhaven. Hi, everyone. I'm Laura, and the Brookhaven model family has struck some tragic luck, no pun intended. But they're trying to bounce back. They're having a competition to see who they should adopt to replace their daughter who was struck by lightning and pretty much died. This is Laura from Brookhaven News signing off. Meanwhile, I can't believe my parents would do this to me. Oh, they're so going to pay for this. They're going to pay for this big time. So your parents are giving you away permanently. They said you're basically dead to them. <laughs> Meanwhile, something is going on girly and we need to figure it out right now. Excuse me. Yeah. Yes? What's going on? Oh, nothing. Just some sale or something. I'm, uh, not really sure though. But mommy, what happened to... Shush, honey. Remember what I said earlier? <laughs> Sorry about my daughter. Thanks for the help, I guess. Did you see that? Yeah, I did. She was sweating lies. This is ridiculous. Something big is going on. And no one is telling us anything. Like, it's craziness. Ugh. A few moments later. Huh? What? What happened to me? I wish I knew, because you look like you belong on the cover of Vogue magazine. Huh? You got hit by lightning. Now, all of a sudden, you're like the most beautiful baddie on the planet. Jeez, where's my lightning bolt? Say what? My God, what happened to my face? It's the most beautiful face in the world. That's what happened. And we are officially adopting you and making you part of the Brookhaven model family. Um, am I dreaming, Sky? Ouch! What the heck was that? Yeah, you're not dreaming. Hey, I'm not? So I got adopted by a model family? Yes, you most certainly did. All I see is dollar signs. Moments later. Oh, I'm so nervous. Hurry up already. We don't have all day. Give me a second. Who on earth are you? You look like a model version of Mackenzie. Hey, Mackenzie, come check this out. It's me, Mom. What did you do? That doesn't matter right now. I've come to tell you that I'm being adopted. What are you saying? right now. You're speaking things I can't understand. She's moving on to bigger and better things, clearly. You're ditching me for these jerks 
with no personalities? Keep my wife's name out your darn mouth, Missy. Oh, yeah? No point in wasting our time here. We're gonna leave now. No hard feelings, bro. Is this really what you want again, Dee? A few moments later. You must be Mackenzie's mom. Not anymore. She's dead to me. Don't worry. I hate her, too. And her stupid parents. You can say that again. Who are you? I'm their real daughter. But since I was hit by lightning and lost all of my beauty, they don't want me anymore. <laughs> Wow, so kind. I'm so sorry, you just caught me off guard a little bit. It's fine, I'm not here for compliments. I'm here so that we can form a team to mutually help each other and get back at those who hurt us. Who are you? I'm part of the Brookhaven model family, and when Mackenzie was hit by lightning, she took all of my beauty. The next day... Can I get a frappuccino? Uh, of course you can. <laughs> Fraps are for kids who don't want to be models, sweetie. We will get three iced waters. Oh, man. Later that same evening. Oh, whoops. Didn't mean to do that. Did you want to be homeless? No. Then you better get your act together because we don't allow losers to live with us. Have you ever even modeled before? No. Of course you haven't. You are going to have to train every second of every... <laughs> practicing my modeling skills. That is so bougie! Hey, give me that! Hey! Never call Mackenzie again. She's too busy for you and she has way better things to do than hang out with you. Now, get back to work, Mackenzie. We don't have all day. A few moments later. Is it finally dinner? I am so hungry. Yes. I don't smell anything tasty. What's for dinner? Broccoli and lots and lots of water. Seriously? Are you complaining? No, that just sounds kind of boring and gross. Well, things are different when you have to be the best. Meanwhile, we should get a voodoo doll and cast bad luck on them. Those aren't real. Yeah, whatever you say, I'm definitely rolling my eyes in my head right now. Because your idea sucks, sorry, I'm trying to make a good plan to get back at them and make things go back to normal. Well, I've been throwing ideas at you all day and you've just been sitting there and knocking them down. Why don't you come up with an idea? Well, I'm trying to, but it's not that easy. Exactly, so let's use mine. No! Meanwhile... I can't believe she's cutting me out of her life like that. What kind of friend does that? A bad one. There's gonna be some way I can stop this and make things go back to the way they used to be. Moments later... Why is this so hard? I can barely breathe. And why do people do this? You can see. The big modeling competition is next week. Stop being so darn lazy. If you're not ready for this competition next week, you're gonna make us look bad, and we will be very upset. We won't just be upset. We'll be giving you up for adoption. I'm running as fast as I can. Please don't do that. A few moments later. Yuck, this is so gross. You better finish it. I can't feel my arms right now. I don't care. Keep lifting. Again. Again. But what am I doing wrong? More confidence, sweetie. Just don't suck. This is starting to feel like a nightmare. Only 10 more miles to go. Somehow this is getting a little easier. How was that? Terrible. It was somewhat better. Meanwhile. We have literally been plotting for like a week and nothing is happening. Ugh. We just have to give up. This is going nowhere. <laughs> I wish Mackenzie was never hit by lightning. Then she wouldn't be all beautiful and this would have never happened. <gasps> Mackenzie's mom. That's genius. You did it. That's it. I know exactly what to do. What do you mean? We have to get Mackenzie hit by lightning again and then me to get hit by lightning right after and then everything will go back to normal how are we gonna do that the lightning dance we need to get mckenzie back i cannot take this anymore who the heck are you you're a little late to the party who the heck am i who the heck are you I'm trying to make everything go back to normal so don't worry about it anyways mckenzie is probably under a strict training protocol because the competition is tomorrow so we'll strike that the next day i'm all ready for the competition man i hope i don't fail hey stop right what are you doing? Lightning dance! Lightning dance! Whatever does it mean? Get out of here, you crazy lady! Um, what the heck was that? A few moments later... She has no idea what she's doing. Yeah, this is awful. Hey, Mackenzie, why don't you do a catwalk for us? Okay, yeah, for sure! Whoa, ouch! <laughs> okay, okay, I've definitely seen enough. Moments later... It's we're not the number one modeling family in Brookhaven anymore. Nice going, Mackenzie. Well, I guess modeling just isn't for me. Peace. Later that night. Oh, boy. Am I glad to see you both. Can you look the same? I miss you guys, and modeling is definitely not for me. I miss you too, girlie. <laughs>